Well, it just goes to show, and it's something we've seen over the years, that you never really know what's going on inside a locker room unless, like you guys, you were inside the locker room. From, from where you sit, how could have LeBron James or the Cavaliers kept Kyrie happy enough to want to stay? I uh, gave him an extension <laughs> uh, for, for, you know, $200 million. I, I, I don't think this was about uh, Kyrie not liking LeBron or, or anything, uh, you know, that's that everybody wants to kind of hit the subplot with. I really do think that, you know, when you win a championship and you're, you know, 24, 25 years old, you look around the league, you see Steph Curry getting paid, you see John Wall getting paid, you see the top point guards getting paid, and you want to get paid. And the opportunity to go play in Boston, uh, play for Brad Stevens, play, you know, in that Celtic organization, you know, it's, it's very appealing and very attractive. Now. You know, we, we want to think that it's something more. I really don't think there's anything more to it. I, I've known LeBron. I know Kyrie. I, don't, I didn't see any bitterness in terms of I don't like you as a person, I hate you, or any stuff like that. I think it really was a business decision that he made. It was the right business decision that he made, and it was the right business decision that he made at the right time. <laughs> I'm going to take it a step further, because I think Isaiah hits it on, on the head. When you're 24 and you're a great player, Kyrie Irving believes he is the best player in the world. And he doesn't believe it, like, from an ego standpoint. Like, he really genuinely believes it. Mm -hmm. Russell Westbrook believes it. James Harden. Like, they really believe it. And so for Kyrie, when you're that, when you're a young, great player, you want to find out what your ceiling is. Because as great as he was in Cleveland, he was still second to LeBron. So even if they'd won it last year, it, LeBron would have been the MVP of the finals. But Greg, don't you think like, okay, you name Westbrook, you name Harden. And, and we, as, we, mm -hmm. we former players, right? We sit in the locker room and yeah, we want to compete on the floor, but we also want to compete with the paycheck. Yeah. You know, you looking around and you like, okay, Westbrook just got, he just got crazy money. Harden just got crazy money. I've won a championship. I'm that dude, I got to get paid. And I can't get paid while LeBron is still here because next year, you know, LeBron's getting $200 million. Okay, so. If he wants it. If he wants it. So when do I get paid, right? And everybody's like, well, you got to wait two years. And with as much money floating around right now, mm. th in my opinion, Kyrie Irving made a business decision and it's not anything personal against LeBron or Cleveland, or anybody else, hmm. I can go to Boston, I can get an extension, I can get paid. And But he also, think of it after LeBron potentially leaves next year. I don't think so, LeBron No, 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 I don't, I'm not saying, but yeah. if you thought he was, the fact that he's in Boston, where he's with a team that's going to be a contender for the next five to eight years, right. and he's unquestionably the best player. And the core is in place, not going anywhere. At least yeah. it doesn't appear that way. My, hey, Matt, my theory was, was that he didn't know and just didn't. He thought to himself, I've been the guy in Cleveland without LeBron before, and that didn't go very well. But he I, wasn't a player I, he was now. I, I True, think, but. I don't think guys can come out and say, hey, it's about the money. But when I look at it, I'm. Very few know, do, but. I, I think I'm following the money trail. <laughs> okay. To me, this is right. about. Okay, it's like when, when I think uh, Bill Russell always had in his contract. I need to get one dollar more <laughs> than Wilt well, Chamberlain. Yeah. Right. We do have the money ego. Sure. <laughs> okay. Sure, I get and, that. And I think that's what this was all about. It